Istanbul is the most beautiful and the most famous city in Turkey. This is one of the places where the ancient Ottoman Empire thrived. Today, Istanbul is a city of modern beauty as well as ancient history. The city is littered with cats that roam the streets, rooftop shops and restaurants like kings and queens. According to some estimates, Istanbul is home to about 1.3 lakh cats, a city of cats. Istanbul is a city where the ordinary animal cat lives an extraordinary life. For the Turks, the cat is a symbol of indestructible urban life, culture and rich heritage. This is a city of cats where cats roam free. Humans exist here to take care of them. The ancient Ottoman Sultans were cat lovers. Being Muslims, they followed the Prophet Muhammad's love for cats. The Ottoman Empire was also a very important trading center of the times. The biggest nuisance in the granaries where the grains are stored were the rats that ate everything en masse. To get rid of the menace, the cats were the most effective way. They ate the rats and saved the people from loss of wealth and many contagious diseases. Naturally, they became the beloveds. Also, Ottomans kept themselves very clean as they had to pray five times a day. Cats always kept their bodies clean by constantly licking off dirt from their bodies. A perfect pet. Rats were a threat not only to merchants and traders but also to Arab scholars and poets who were very renowned in the Ottoman Empire. The rats quanted all their writings. They ate through pages of books, bit off the pages to make their nests. Therefore, in most of the houses and almost all the libraries, cats were a royal presence. Arabic scholars from that era are often drawn with a cat or two near them, the guards of their knowledge. Cats soon found a special place in Turkish lore and society. Culture, practicality and myths all came together to offer them this unique standard. There is an unwritten law in Istanbul. Cats are not anyone's pet, nor they are street cats. They belong to the city, to all city dwellers. It's a job of every city man and woman to protect them. Municipality provides special food, water and shelter homes for the street cats. The cats walk into the shops and restaurants with a sense of urgency, demanding food. Owners comply. At times, they ask the guests to share their food too. When you sit in a restaurant, they begin to scratch your skin demandingly. When you start eating, they will try getting your attention and will only be happy once they get their fill. Once the bellies are full, it's time for showing their gratitude. And they show it plenty. Some cats in Istanbul are world famous celebrities. The most famous of these is Glee, a cat that lived in Hagia Sophia. The darling of the visitors to Hagia Sophia, Glee had 120,000 Instagram followers when she died in 2020. One of her followers is Obama and also many celebrities like him. There are two types of indigenous cats found only in Turkey, the Turkish Angora and the Turkish Van. Van cats can have two different colors in two eyes. Kedi, a popular Turkish documentary about the life of seven cats in Istanbul, has won numerous awards around the world. In Istanbul, cats are not only pampered pets, but also wonderful creatures that give the people around them glimpses of a wild world. A world of freedom, wildness and self-sufficiency. A world where you live freely. A cultural reminder of what and who the city people were as well as showing them that life could be lived openly rather than inside the four walls where we confine ourselves. The next time you go to Turkey, pay close attention. You will see small bowls and plates and food containers lining the sides of streets, apartments and houses. You will see friendly dogs and cats gorging on delicacies. You should share some food with them and maybe take a different kind of selfie.